Hi guys, this is Everything Apple Pro. In this video, I'm going to show you how to change your carrier on your iPhone or iPod Touch. And now, there have been some compatibility issues with Make It Mine, which is a really popular way to do this on the newer firmwares. And I'm going to show you a little replacement that works just as well. And as you can see, I already have a little Verizon logo right there. And hopefully, one day, there will be a Verizon iPhone. But in the meantime, I could enjoy or pretend that I have Verizon right now. The most popular way to do this is called Make It Mine and it's been around for a long time. Now I have found that it works on some iPhones and iPods on 4.2.1 and 4.1 while it doesn't work on others. But it is probably the easiest thing that you can do. Now when you install it, it will look like this on your springboard. And when you open it, uh, you have options for a carrier and a banner which is up here. Now on the banner you can just type in anything you want and it will appear automatically. But when you're trying to do a carrier you're going to have to press it and then respring for it to appear. And that's make it mine. Now on my iPhone it doesn't support retina display so it's white and it will work on some and I don't know why it doesn't work on others. But the other thing you can do is called fake operator. And I found that this works too. And when you install it, it might ask you to reboot, but if you head over to settings and you scroll down to where it says fake operator, and you can toggle it on and off here, and you can type in whatever you want. Now, I'm not going to type it in because I have Make It Mine installed and it will just interfere, but if I'm correct, it should appear right away. If it doesn't, you can reboot for it to appear. And that's it, guys. That's how you change your carrier logo on your iPhone or iPod Touch or just the text. And thanks for watching, guys. Please comment, rate, and subscribe.